In a future where technology had seamlessly integrated with human existence, a powerful alliance of machines and flesh emerged. One unique creation, known as Cyborg 17, stood as the pinnacle of this harmonious fusion. Part human, part machine, Cyborg 17 possessed unparalleled strength, intellect, and an unbreakable determination to protect the planet Earth from any threat that dared to jeopardize its safety. With circuits humming and a heart that beats with the memory of its human origins, Cyborg 17 must embark on a mission to protect Mother Earth from the evil eye organization. As battles wage amidst starlit backdrops, within the shadowy recesses of space stations harboring dark secrets. The tension between Cyborg 17's technological prowess and its lingering human emotions paints a complex portrait of a defender torn between duty and identity. As the clash with the evil eye organization escalates, Cyborg 17's journey becomes a cosmic ballet of strategy, loyalty, and self-discovery, its ultimate fate intertwined with the destiny of both Earth and the galaxies it traverses. Hello 17, welcome to training. Grab your blaster or pistol and let's get ready to start. To equip your pistol or blaster, reach down and press the grab button to grab them out of your holster. Both the pistol and the blaster are permanently attached to your hand once equipped. To put them back in the holster simply hover your pistol or blaster over the holster and press the grab button. Awesome! Now let's get some practice by shooting those boxes up ahead. Behind the door there will be some enemies to kill. Blast open the door to proceed. Good shooting 17, you handled those enemies like a boss. Now around the corner, there will be some health and armor packs that you can pick up with the grab button and release the grab button to use. The green bar on your wrist represents your health and the blue bar represents your armor. Once your armor bar is depleted then your health bar will start to deplete as well. Once your health bar is depleted then, well, it's game over, literally. Behind the next door you will find a couple melee weapons that you can use on enemies that get too close. These weapons are typically a one-hit kill unless it is a more powerful enemy then a few hits may be needed. There are two enemies around the corner and down the hall and they have their backs turned so they cannot see you coming. Use the melee weapon to perform a one-hit kill by swinging your weapon and slashing them into pieces. job 17 around the next corner is grenade training simply pick up the grenade with your grab button and press the trigger to activate the grenade once activated you will hear three beeps and see the grenade flash three times before it explodes make sure to toss it before the third beep or behind the next door is shield training to use the shield pick it up with the grab button and press the trigger to activate it to deactivate the shield, press the trigger a second time if you want to turn it off and save its power. Also, if you ever have to sit the shield down to grab other items make sure to deactivate it first with the trigger button before setting it down or it may malfunction. There are two enemies around the corner, try using the shield to block their projectiles. Also remember the shield gets weaker with every hit it takes and will eventually not work anymore once it is armor compromised. to my favorite part, parkour training. You must make it across all the platforms in order to reach the checkpoint at the end. Nice jumping. This next jump is a little bit farther. To make this next jump, you will need to perform a running double jump. Pre Amazing jump. Now you must make it across the moving platforms to the checkpoint up ahead. You can do this 17. I have faith in you.
Job 7, switch your blaster type by pressing the weapon switch button. You will up behind the door are some more enemies. Now it's time to practice your charge blast. Your regular blaster is the only blaster that has a charge blast. Your sonar blaster and all other blasters do not have this capability. To charge your blaster, simply press and hold the trigger for two seconds until you see the front awesome shooting. To sprint, press in the left stick to activate sprint mode and run to the end of this long hallway for practice. To switch nice running 17, you are really fast. If you would like to switch between snap turning and smooth turning, simply press in the right stick to switch between snap and smooth to be on the lookout for hidden items and weapons in every level, including ammo for some of the different types of blasters you may unlock. Well done 17, approach the spaceship to leave training.
Oh, <laughs> 